Coach, five match winning streak, 1-0 and in conference. You know, it's exciting. Uh, the 1-0 and in conference is really the, the most important number to me right now and to the team. Uh, you know, the 5-0 and is, is nice in our last five matches, but, uh, you know, it's, it's a whole new season. It's time for conference. It's time to be at our best uh, every single night. And, uh, you know, we're gunning for, you know, a conference championship here. You went down big early in the first set against NJIT. NJIT took that set. And then your team responded with just dominant second and third sets and then won a classic fourth set. Did you say something to your team that got them to turn it around like that? Um, honestly, it was a lot about them, them believing in each other, them you know, being a little embarrassed uh, that you know, we, we played awful, honestly. And they knew it, and they knew that we could turn around and play better. Um, you know, I kind of said something along the lines of, wow, that was a little embarrassing or something along those terms, but, uh, you know, they, they knew it. I didn't really have to say it, but, uh, you know, it was one of those things where we knew we could be better. Uh, it didn't phase them to have that little hiccup there. Um, you know, I could see it in their eyes that they trusted each other and that we were going to come out and play better. And, you know, we did, we, we did our jobs in set two and set three, and then set four was just a battle back and forth. Uh, Actually getting down a little bit at, at the beginning of it you know it was good to see the girls come back from that uh, we, di we didn't let up we didn't give up and uh, you know Krista with a huge block there at the end to finish it off was a, a nice exclamation point what can you tell us about Utah Valley they're big um, they've got some experience but they've got some young players filling in spots as well right now uh, one of their big guns has moved out of the middle to the right this year and so it gives them a, a sizable block there uh, if we can go with some tempo, if we can beat the block and get it into their back row players and their defense, you know, we're, we're going to battle and we're going to have a, a shot to be successful in this match. If we try and go up and overpower their big blockers and play a ball, you know, play a game that's right on top of the tape, we're going to struggle. We're going to have, you know, have our hands full. But uh, it's going to be a good benchmark for where we are right now. It's going to, you know, be a, a huge crowd. I think we're going to have you know the crowd behind us. We're going to have the, the home court behind us. Um, you know, UVU on the road. They came in here last year and we gave them a battle in set one. I think it was a 26-24 loss and things like that. So we know we can play against them. We know we we can compete, and uh, we just have to you know, continue what we've we've been building the last few matches.